Hey, good evening everyone. Good to see you all. Let's go ahead and get uh, the third session of this underway. For those that may be wondering or didn't even read this morning's community post, not the one I put on, put out yesterday. Um, the streamer Power to Mario was supposed to be doing a Name That Game tune, which would have been going right about now. But um, he had to postpone it to next week because of um, <laughs> outbreak stuff going on. <laughs> But it'll be held next Thursday at 6 p.m. Central <laughs> on his Twitch channel. So <laughs> since he couldn't do it tonight, we'll just do the third session of this now. And that definitely makes up for the missed session I did. The, the missed session I had back on uh, Thursday of last week. Yeah, I'll just say that. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, if I remember right, we last left off... Uh, Getting all those um, things taken care of around here, so might as well uh, go to the uh, islands that need pearl sets. <laughs> Are you gonna hack uh, Animal Crossing when I get it? No, no, I don't think so. And by the way, when it comes to Animal Crossing, I'm not one of those people that likes to do uh, time travel as much. I really like to play it naturally based on um, what day it is and everything. I only like turn the clock backwards if I really missed a day or something, but I'm not gonna make it go forward at any day. I would rather um, celebrate the kind of uh, day you'd be having once you get to it. Mario Man? <laughs> So yeah, Mario Man really should be here for these uh, Wind Waker streams. I mean, I have a name that's like perfect for... I have a file name that's like perfect for this run. I really do. And yeah, every time those monsters come up, the frame rate seems to drop substantially. <laughs> it could be that I am running this on a uh, physical copy. Okay, uh, need to go this way for this island here. Let me make sure I have some bait. Oh boy, these kind of enemies. What are you going to do this Sunday then? Oh, yes. Um, I originally said I was going to do um, the third session of uh, Wind Waker that day. And I could have done the fourth one this Sunday. But something um, crazily just dropped today. It was a next another update to the game Boris and the Dark Survival. So I'm going to stream that on Sunday as instead. So this kind of uh, Wind Waker stream kind of makes up for that Sunday as well. Which, um, I, I don't understand how uh, timing like this works. I really have no idea. Oh. <laughs> Two pearls remain. <laughs> Trying to get out of here. I want to go up for the next one. Yeah, it's awfully quiet here. <laughs> it's 
six hour reef. Okay, I'm going up for another pearl. Stay away from that. We will be combating those big twisters later on, but I don't have the weapon necessary for it right now. You should host whoever is doing the name that video game tune once they do it. Well, um, here's the problem, uh... Nightwish, if I just host it on here, you can't really participate in it. You have to be in Power to Mario's uh, stream for it. I'll host it just to remind people that it's going on, but don't try to uh, chat on my end of it, on the host's end of it. Make sure you're in the, the actual streamer's channel themselves, not, not really mine. Eh, hold on. I mean, I can't tilt the camera up or down. That's why I'm doing this. That's better. I mean, I can tilt it sideways, but I can't tilt it up and down. football fan at all but Brady to the Bucks <laughs> I think you said something like that last night kitty <laughs> Yeah, I was re repeatedly tapping B with that text box. And it made me, uh, <laughs> get off the boat. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I did. <laughs> oh, did that reach it? Oh, not quite. No, you're supposed to just, uh, drop it. That's better. Anyways, this great fairy should give me a uh, bomb upgrade. You can now carry more bombs up to 60. Then I want to check. Do I still have a... Uh... Oh, that's right. My bottle is filled with uh, grandma's soup. Hm. Okay, how are we at on the map? Hm. Maybe I need uh, some more bait. Then, go down a couple squares. And, Uh, 
Oh, that's better. I actually did it just by pressing a ZL to reset it. That, that definitely speeds things up. Private Oasis. <laughs> This should be the way up to that last uh, island to deposit the last pearl. got a uh, marker set for this one. However, before we uh, go to this island, there's something over here I want to check. What are these guys doing? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Mighty fine bow you got there, bub. You must be searching for treasure on the seafloor too, aren't you? Alright, you won't get any from us, bub. Not likely. Let me ask you something real quick. Who wanders around on a fishless sea? Tell you who, bub. Only pirates, monsters, and treasure hunters like ourselves, and maybe some other things that I've never heard of. You know, with all the weak island dwellers who never leave their shores, I'm amazed to see such a tiny little guy out here. Like your style, bub. I feel like I've known you my whole life. So hey, bub, tell you what, as one treasure hunter to another will give you this, you'll definitely be needing if you want to haul up treasure. Come on, take it. I won't take no for an answer. I also won't take nay, nope, or nar. Just grab it. Treasure chart. <laughs> Open your map. Blah, blah, blah. Grappling hooks. Happy auntie. I don't know if those, um... Three guys up there sounded like yes men or what? Nar. <laughs> Apparently so. When's the next name that game to in a week from Saturday? The last Saturday of each month. Thought you knew that by now. Alrighty. The best cutscene in any Zelda game. say the vibration on the gamepad isn't that uh, strong <laughs> now it kind of is <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
This tower which the Pearl of the Gods has caused to appear is a place that the gods of the ancient world prepared so that they may test the courage of men. <laughs> Only one who is able to overcome the trials that await here will be acknowledged by the gods to be a true hero. Only then will that hero be permitted to wield the power to destroy the great evil. Toon hack that which you must obtain now lies before you. Must believe in your own courage. Must rise above the trial of the gods. Before we go in, let me see if one of the fish is around. Because the fish wasn't going to appear until the tower rose up. Yep, there he is. Okay, so I only have just outside borders of the whole map left. Steering here is pretty hard. But anyways, we're gonna make it in. Alrighty, Tower of the Gods dungeon. This is gonna be quite, quite the place. <laughs> Break those walls open. Can't go to those quite yet because we don't have a key. Just got in before that water rose. The tower rising from the water reminds me of something from a movie. Um, I can't think of a movie that has that reference. I need to uh, switch out items here. Yeah, yellow choo choos have. Um, electricity on themselves. <laughs> uh oh, did I really destroy the box? I'm gonna wait till the water lo lowers so that I can, um, don't destroy that box. Alright. I'm kinda of worried I would get hit by the bomb there, but thankfully no. Alrighty, let's try an outside throw. Eh, uh, it doesn't quite reach.
That's better. Well, not gonna reach that. Okay, that too should come down. Oops. So uh, there was a joy pendant there, which is actually something we need. Reminds me of the ships rising for the ice in Rise of Skywalker. Oh. Huh. Not even the sail works in here. Even if you use the fast sail. Step on that, but I can't get it open. Gotta do that instead. I'm trying to figure this out. Do I need a... Uh... Oh, oh, I know. I need to set um, one of these boxes here on that switch down there. Yeah, set up that kind of bridge there. Gonna have to wait till the water lowers again to create that bridge. I get Jim Carrey vibes for Madame Toadstool. Really? Have you told her that? Okay, that's open. No. <laughs> Figured it didn't. <laughs> okay, I better make it on here. <laughs> Can I still get in with, uh, I can't, <laughs> don't need the uh, second one down. Oh, then I need to set these crates. Need to push this one over a couple inches and then push it this way. Make sure there's not too much of a gap between these crates. No, 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 Link, you're supposed to... I was pressing A to grab it, but he decided to roll instead. Okay, I'm gonna wait till the water rises again because, um... If I leave fire on this stick too long, the stick will probably burn out. When am I going to stream Mario Maker 2 again? I don't know at this point. I'm kind of worried that people will give me, uh... 
um, cues for level codes, which I really don't want right now. Plus, um, Mario Man keeps begging me to uh, challenge him in these uh, online multiplayer levels, but when there's just too much lag involved with them, I just can't do them. Uh, thankfully, I made it past those guys. <laughs> wow, what a view that is. <laughs> get in here for now. Alrighty, got him killed before the water rose up. Still gotta wait till the water lowers to get back through that door again. Hopefully that one chest is still there it is. Now there's a way forward. <laughs> Another joy pendant. And I don't need him, I can just swim over to it right here. That's still kind of stupid, I can't roll on steps like that. Oh, the rats. And you also got one of those laser beam things. Let me see if I can kill off the laser beam with this. Oh yeah. Just so that it doesn't bother me so much. <laughs> Oh, didn't quite make it. Oh, just bounced off it. That, it's still not on. That's better. Ooh, just made it on it. How cool is that? <laughs> I don't think there's really anything on that, is there? Yep. 
Now, what's the point of this platform? Probably nothing, but, uh, fell a little ways. Oh, this main room here. Seeker of the Goddess's guidepost. Press ZR to call me to guide me to my place of truth. <laughs> Ooh, I didn't think I was going to make it to it. Oh, man. That would have been very disastrous if I didn't make it. Am I late or am I late? Yes, you're kind of late. Well, you better not be late to tomorrow's stream. Because I think you'll really like the kind of challenge that goes along with it. Wind Waker. Wait. You learn the command melody. My kin wait beyond the doors. Control them and guide them to their places of truth to open the path to the gods. Just made it. Right, wrong button. Till Link should have been unlockable in Smash 4. Huh. Control this guy to get him to the door. Because if I take go off that switch, the bridge will disappear. And yeah, look at um, Toon Link right there. <laughs> then like a Zen mode right there. <laughs> okay. Where is everyone? <laughs> yeah. I could say, Jeremy, a lot of my LP streams get um, low viewership, and I can understand that. It can be a game that they're just not interested in playing, and I totally understand that, but... Um...
But I still want to play this game because I just enjoy it. I'm afraid there are some areas to which you will not be able to bring the servants of the tower. But do not fear leaving them behind. Once you have awakened them, they will wait patiently for your return. Of this, I assure you. Well, nice. <laughs> I have to take off some of his armor. There, now his armor is off. <laughs> yeah, to grab a knight's crest, that's what I was doing it for. Ooh! <laughs> I got his big weapon, I got a big advantage! <laughs> yeah, if you can knock weapons like that out of their hands, you're going to get a big advantage. But it's still tough to use because it's heavier than the sword. <laughs> oh, one of the biggest items we've been waiting all game to use is finally here. You got the hero's bow. We can finally use a bow and arrow. Can carry up to 30, though. Oh, and by the way, use this thing. You can knock over these pillars. And sometimes if you knock over a pillar, you may get rupees and such from them. But unfortunately, this room's just not giving me any. That's like two of Toon Link's size. <laughs> that's a that's a pretty good point. Okay, um... Uh, hello? Why isn't it... Reacting. There we go. <laughs> One of those hitbox issues again. Huh, and those things have come to life. <laughs> I really want to get rid of the bats before I proceed. Eh, I don't want to waste any more arrows. Thankfully I didn't fall in the water. Oh! 
just landed in the water before it could explode. It still didn't reach that? Really? <laughs> eh. Mistimed that. That's better. <clears throat> oh, these enemies. Oh, wait a second, I have to uh, use the ocarina. No, not the ocarina, the wind waker. <laughs> need to beat these guys all I have the way to beat them though is to toss a bomb in their mouths <laughs> that's what I did that for I didn't go straight. That's better. That has a bomb. That has arrows. Watch your step. Yeah, I know. That's because um, Toon Link went at an angle when I tried to make a jump. I don't know how, but it just did. Got the next key. Well, at least I got that guy. for that one platform to come back. <gasps> no! Uh, down to one heart. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? Let me uh, take a sip of this. Jeez, come on, Link. Make the right jump. Ooh, oh, jeez. Rolling really shouldn't be a thing, but it's designed to uh, prevent yourself from getting hurt from falling after a uh, very high jump. That's better. Uh-oh. Another joy pendant. <laughs> Let me uh, put this back on. Speed this up a lot better. 
That's better. Now we can go up. <laughs> Don't know why that had to be so hard. Yeah, I get two of those over there so that um, they don't balance with each other when Link gets on it. Get this guy on this switch here. So that Tuna can get back through that. Oh, this notorious enemy. Well, at least he only takes just two hits. Toss a third one on there though, so that uh, three of these uh, equal more than two of these here over here. Yep. And there we go. That's the last one. Seriously? Eh, that guy's still not destroyed. See, I destroyed the other one earlier. There, that's better. Unfortunately, that took away quite a few hearts. spot right there. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if you really heard that. The oh. And the sound they make after you hit their backs a couple times, like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Is 
They want to target that bird. Alrighty. Very. <laughs> Make sure I got everything else. You have done well to find your way to this place. Oh, chosen one. Accept this final challenge. Universe Samuel, bro, you speedrun? No, I'm not speedrunning this game. This is just a casual playthrough. I mean, I do speedrun some games, but I don't speedrun this. <laughs> onto this hand here. Uh, n he's still not down the heck? There. Uh. Alright, come on. Now we can go for his head. This is the same boss as in Mario Odyssey. I kind of compare him to uh, Andros from Star Fox. <laughs> he gives me more arrows. <laughs> That should do it. The path can now be opened. Oh, chosen one. 
What will now come to pass is tied to your fate, to the path that you have chosen. Go forward with caution. You have done well, Toon Hack. <laughs> it would seem the gods have acknowledged you to be a true hero. But this does not mean your trials have ended here. Once you take your first step into the world beyond the ring of light you see shimmering in the waves before you, your true trial will begin. <laughs> this is what's happening. Yeah, in the Wii, Wii U version, they seem to have made <laughs> this submerged town into a sepia tone colored <laughs> setting. But in the GameCube version, it would be in a grayscale. I don't know if sepia just makes it is the reason for a more HD tone for it. You're probably wondering where we are, aren't you? Unfortunately, not enough time for me to explain it to you now. Once you are able to strike down Ganon with the item you obtain in this castle, all will be made clear to you. Trust in my words, see what awaits you in the castle. Say, what does this remind you guys of? I mean, you got monsters like Frozen here. <laughs> hey. The item you seek is hidden somewhere in the castle. To find it, you must find the entrance to the basement. That entrance has been blocked by a mighty threshold firmly sealed to prevent evil from ever gaining access. Do you know where to search and what you must do to open the hidden way? You will find a clue in the shape of a heraldry near where we arrived at the castle. in place.
Eh, nope, didn't want to push it that way. But this will work. That's better. Excellent, to an act to perceive such a puzzle and decipher it is no small feat. Now take the sword that lies before you. It is none other than the Master Sword, the Blade of Evil's Bane. The only sword that could banish Ganon from the world above. Getting some color in this place. Well, I'm in trouble. I got work to do. You got the Master Sword, the legendary blade with the power to repel evil once wielded by the legendary hero himself. <laughs> so, think I can beat all these uh, enemies without getting the game over, guys? Trying to. Oh, yeah, only cost one heart. How did he swing in and miss on me right there? Okay. Go get him. Took two hearts. That that big Sweeney took right there. I 
have a fairy in a bottle, so... I can lose all my hearts once. But let's just hope I can still make it through. I got an idea. <laughs> We're gonna throw this at, um... That guy right there. Let's see if he comes. Okay. See, so he really needs to slow down. Can't go out yet till all these guys get BTFO'd. Oh, well, still got that fairy. here. Okay, it looks like there's only a couple more left. Ooh! Not sure how I avoided that attack.
All right, two more to go. Oh god, just one heart left. And only that guy left. did it. At least I didn't get a game over, otherwise I would have had to do all this all over again. That would have taken up so much time. Okay. At long last, our preparations are complete. You must return to me so that we can return by the same path that brought us here. The time has come to save your sister from her prison in the Forsaken Fortress. Hurry, Tunak. Whew. Let's see what this beetle shop has. Preston has returned. <laughs> Tell you what, Preston, you missed uh, the epic battle I had with all those big enemies. Nah, uh, I don't need any of those. Now Jeremy has returned. I'm gonna try this way. Sorry, my radio had gone off. It was a severe thunderstorm warning. Yeah. Yeah, we actually had storms this morning. It was um, thundering pretty loudly <laughs> by the time I woke up.
I just got a pop-up scam. That's weird. Whoa, frame rate is really, really dropping. I'm gonna do this really quick. Because I know that destroying these particular cannons here. Oh, well, at least I got that one. Oh! The heck? <laughs> wow. I was trying to put away the cannons so that I could um, check out my surroundings and everything, but it wouldn't let me. Where do I start back at? Oh, j same here. Fine. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to try this again. Nah, that's actually not my first game over. There. I was trying to put it away so that I could see. And that thing keeps driving me crazy. First game over this stream. <laughs> okay. Uh, I just realized I'm not going to be able to reach that pillar up there because I don't have uh, the hook shot. Okay, say so I want to make sure that I get that uh, big twister guy taken care of before we go to Forsaken Fortress. And there hasn't been a single sight of him since heading west from the uh, Tower of the Gods. How you doing, Tunak? Do you have enough of granny soup? Where are you now? You may be closer than I suspect. <laughs> are you hungry? Are you keeping warm? You haven't injured yourself, have you? 
You always work so hard. Do you have enough rupees? Your grandma doesn't have a lot, so I'm sending you everything I've saved up. As long as you have you and Errol, I don't need anything else. Just want the two of you to return home safely. You only had 20 saved up? Hmm. Uh, this is the fairy fountain I cannot access because I don't have the weapon necessary to get this thing knocked down. Can that twister please show up here? It still isn't. Jeremy pre-ordered <laughs> Animal Crossing. Uh oh. Oh. Yeah, those uh, exploding barrels uh, kept me. Eh? Preoccupied. There we go. going to Forsaken Fortress quite yet, because I still haven't gotten that uh, Twister to show up yet. I mean, I could still do it at a later point in the game. There we go! There he is. Foolish creature who does not fear the gods to the end of the sea with you. Let the winds of Cyclos' wrath blow you away. Why are my shots not going? He's, he's gonna take. Okay. I got kind of worried there. I'm like, if I don't get three hits on him... I'm gonna get sucked up and move to a new place on the map. Heck of an arm you got there. And what an eye. No one's ever been able to spot me in there before now. You obviously have mastery of the air, and now that we've established that you're quite the wind waker, let's see if you can handle this. Say, it won't let me do it downward. Alright, let's try it now. Uh, it's still not letting me do it. It won't let me go down. Or up. Wow. Hold on a second. I think I can still do it this way. Yeah, I glided my finger on the gamepad. Wow. Well, at least I got it to work. <laughs> In the hands of a wind waker like you, my adorable little cyclones will be as happy as can be. If you need to move like the wind over the ocean deeps, just call on my cyclones. Well, I guess I'll head for home now. See you on down the road. Alrighty. But I'm also going to check out this one island to the east right here before we head to the fortress because um, there is a certain mini game I can play. Yeah, this one right here. This is one we tried visiting earlier, but. Uh, 
it didn't work because of the uh, overnight rainstorm. Never mind, my mistake. Yeah, yeah, step right up. If you have confidence in your target shooting, why don't you give this a shot? It's 50 rupees per game. I'm fine. So you're the little shrimp who thinks he's a hard target shooting hot shot, yeah? And you say this knowing full well that we are pirates who are fr so frightening that crying babies shut their mouths when we step into the room? Alright, this should be funny. Fine then, hot shot. If you can manage to sink the five pirate ships you see off on the horizon, we'll acknowledge your skills where they can, and you shrimpy little landlubber. However, we won't tolerate any comments about how the pirate ships look like barrels, and you get only ten shots. You heard me? You can move your cannon with L and fire it with A. Watch the water plumes carefully when you fire, yeah? You got it, shrimp? I got it. If you manage to sink all five pirate ships, we'll give you all the treasure we've stolen up until now. Good luck to you, shrimp. You'll need it, yeah? So, instead of playing some battleship, we're playing some cannon launching. Uh, that one's a little too far. Okay. Okay. Under shot. Let's try 35 degrees. Got it. Only one to go, and I only and I have four shots to get it. Let's try 40. Oh, just a little short. Maybe 45 will do it. Still a little short. Only two shots left. Can 49 finish it off? Oh yeah. Did it with one to spare. Wow, nice shooting. But we won't hand over our priceless treasure so easily, yeah? Miss. Hey, miss. <laughs> Gone, though. You're at least an honorary member of my family, are you not? So act like it. Don't lose your head. <laughs> You're a talented little kid. I like you. As we promised, you're their treasure. It's yours, so take it. Piece of heart completing another heart container. Alright, nice job and all that. You can leave via the ladder behind you. Climb down in an orderly manner, if you please. Now, nah, I'll just do that, if you don't mind. <laughs> okay. I can get one more island uh, check marked by the fish, and then we can head on over to the fortress. I really don't like it when the water is this wavy. Oh, and these barrels. Star Island. I heard that somewhere out in the wide world is a handy arrow that can freeze anything. Hmm. 
Alrighty, now we're heading off to Forsaken Fortress. Now I want to change from light to dark here so quickly. Yeah, see that? It just changed to night just like that. Anyways, we're looking for the entrance, which should be right here. No, 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 no. Alrighty, made it in. I feel like it's the same fish every time. Yeah, it is, but he has uh, different pieces of advice on every section. Ganon has likely been made aware of our little incursion already. But you have the Master Sword. That sword shall shine in the darkness, casting back evil. With it in your hands, none can keep you from rescuing your sister. Do not be afraid. So yeah, second go-around of um, Forsaken Fortress is not that bad, actually. Because guards can't really put you in jail. Well, well, if it isn't one of my most annoying boss enemies in from Hyrule Warriors. Yeah, this guy's been a pain to fight with in Hyrule Warriors quite a lot. Uh, seriously? I guess I took a very early swing. Uh, oh, luckily it hit the ground. Eh, didn't get much out of him there. At least that door is open now. You got the Skull Hammer. This mighty hammer can break things and pound obstacles into the ground. <laughs> Some enemies even get stung by the shock waves it causes when you pound the ground with it. Say. Okay. I mean, just watch how they react. Uh, uh, they weren't supposed to do that, but... <laughs> huh, just squished that one. I didn't get that to work.
Uh, now I have a sword to fight these guys here. Looks like I got a shortcut going here. Hey, don't these enemies sound like elves to you? Jerk! Oh, jeez! Oh, what a jerkish move by that! Monster. <laughs> Uh, seriously? another one down for good measure. <laughs> See if I can get some more magic here. But, geez, made just very tiny contact with that. <laughs> rats to finish tossing the bombs.
piece of heart. Hm. Got hit by that flame. How stupid is that? Who? You would think that's supposed to be like a peeping hole or something like that. some more magic. Eh. I'm not gonna take any chances with these guys. I really need some magic. I'll just grab that. Okay, now we're making some progress. <laughs> Jeez, they're just killed in a flash! <laughs> hey, how much longer are they gonna chase me? It's really pushing me back. Oh, Dane. Well, that's fine. At least I can get, get back up. I guess I need to change the wind direction. Hmm. 
There. I think I need to change it one more time. Can I get some magic from you, elves? <laughs> Apparently, no. So I won't open that easily. There you go, acting before you think as usual. I swear, I didn't even realize that we had to draw that monster bird off for you. It was about to come flying in here after you again. That sword. Where'd you get that? Uh, Jeremy, wrong name there. Are you, is it even possible? How could it be? Well, never mind about that for now. We'll just take these girls. I'm sure their fathers back in town will pay a handsome reward for their return. What do you mean, wrong name? <laughs> it's not Terra. I'm so sorry to interrupt such a heartwarming reunion. But isn't there something that you need to take care of? If you're worried about your sister, don't be. I promise I'll deliver her safely back to your little island. Normally I'd expect a huge re reward for something like this, but this time it's my treat. Listen, Errol, your brother still has some things to take care of. Big, important, grown-up things. No, it's not, Jeremy. He'll be back soon, so you just wait nice and quiet until he returns, okay? But, big brother... <laughs> Miss Tetra! See? That's the name, Jeremy. That's the wrong name. The bird will be here any second. Gonzo, excellent. You're just in time. Take this one for me. Huh? But she's... She's fine. Just do as you're told. Tetra. <laughs> Tetra? <laughs> yeah, you said Terra instead of Tetra. We'll be back, I swear. Hmm. Oh, shoot! That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> Man.
much more is left. As she said, now it's see ya. See, I can say the theme song for this boss is much better in the GameCube version. Been a while, boy. You've done well to sneak into my fortress and wriggle your way all the way up here. I suppose the least I can do is commend you for your reckless courage. I, my name is Ganondorf. I'm the master of Forsaken Fortress. You gotta wonder, how come um, in Smash Brothers, Ganondorf hasn't had this kind of costume choice? By the way, boy, when you drew that sword of yours out of its pedestal, did you by chance notice how all the monsters frozen in time down there suddenly began stirring again? Yep. Do you understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you do. Foolish child, while that sword is indeed the blade of evil's bane at the same time, it has long played another role. You see, it is also a sort of key, a most wretched little key that has kept the seal on me and my magic intact. By withdrawing the blade, you have broken that seal. <laughs> uh, what just happened? You cannot defeat me with a blade that does not sparkle with the power to repel evil. What you hold is useless. 
Go back to the world below and tell that to the pathetic fools who made this blade. Its power is gone, and its edges are dull. <laughs> Tuna, get up! Mm, stop, let, let me go! You pathetic little sea rat. Hmm? My Triforce of Power is resonating. Ah, at long last I have found you, Princess Zelda. W what are you talking about? I don't know any Zelda. Feigning ignorance will gain you nothing. Tell me, if you are not Zelda, then why do you have this fragment of the Triforce? It's alright, Tunak. She has merely lost consciousness. Your sister has escaped the Forsaken Fortress with the pirates. You can relax. She's safe now. Lord Valu, you arrived not a moment too soon. We are deeply grateful. I am aware of this, yet I thought our first priority should be to separate these two from Ganon's grasp. Tunak, I will explain things later. Now we must return to the world beneath the sea. Hmm. Oh. oh. Tunak, you alright? What is this place? Hey, and Ganondorf. What happened to him? What are you doing? You must come now to the room where you got the Master Sword. Who is using that stone? Just who are you? Tunak and I are the only ones who can speak through this stone. How dare you use what's not yours? <laughs> Your name is Tetra, correct? You must come with Tunak to see me at once. Hmm, well don't you sound important. Fine, we're on our way. Just hold your horses, whoever you are. What are you waiting for? You heard the stone. You're supposed to show me how to get to where that voice is. <laughs> Alright, see you later, Super Bowser fan. Although, I should be ending this off after this particular uh, cutscene. Are you him? Are you the one who is speaking through my stone without my permission? Answer me. The stone is an enhanced version of the Gossip Stones long spoken of in the legend of the Hyrulean royal family. I am the one who made it. You made it? The royal family's Gossip Stone? I'm sorry, but I don't know what you're talking about. Have neither of you heard the tales? Tales of the kingdom spoken of in the legend of the great hero, the place where the power of the gods lie hidden? This place where the two of you now stand is that kingdom. This is Hyrule. 
And I am its king, Daphnis Nohansen Hyrule. <laughs> Do you not recognize my voice, Tunheck? Indeed, I am the one who guided you here. I am the king of red lights. No need for me to reveal my true identity to you so long as that blade the Master Sword could defeat Ganon. But now both of you must listen to me. Long ago, this land of Hyrule was turned into a world of shadows by Ganon who sought to obtain the power of the gods for his own evil ends. My power alone could not stop the fiend and our only choice was to leave the fate of the kingdom in the hands of the gods. When the gods heard our pleas, they chose to seal away not only Ganon but Hyrule itself and so with a torrential downpour of rains from the heavens, our fair kingdom was soon buried beneath the waves forgotten at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Yet all was not lost, for the gods knew that to seal the people away with the kingdom would be to grant Ganon's wish for the destruction of the land. So before the sealing of the kingdom, the gods chose those who would build a new country and commanded them to take refuge on the mountaintops. Those people were your ancestors. Hundreds of years have passed since then. So long as Ganondorf was not revived, Hyrule would remain below, never waking from its slumber. Come to meet Etra. This necklace you wear is part of a sacred treasure called the Triforce of Wisdom, which has been passed down for many ages within the royal family of Hyrule. Your mother passed this down to you and instructed you to treasure it and to guard it with your life. Am I not correct? The Triforce of Wisdom is none other than the sacred power of the gods that we have kept from Ganon's clutches for so many long years. The gods placed upon your ancestors the task of protecting it from evil's grasp. You too must abide by the laws of the past, and so the time has come for me to teach you the fate into which you were born, the very reason that you live. You are the true heir of the royal family of Hyrule, the last link in the bloodline. You are Princess Zelda. Zelda, I'm a princess? You are confused, aren't you? I suppose such is to be expected. Tunak, I'm terribly sorry that you've been caught up in these events. But now that it is known that Tetra is indeed Princess Zelda, Ganon will be searching frantically for this child in an attempt to get the power of the gods that she possesses. He will not rest until he has found her. If he succeeds, my ancient kingdom under the sea will be turned into a land of shadow and despair, and so will the world you know above the waves. I need you to lend me your strength in this dark hour. I have a suspicion about what has caused the Master Sword to lose its power. I need for you to come with me back to the lands above the water and re return the power to repel evil to the Master Sword. Zelda, it is far too dangerous for you to join us in this task. Fortunately, this sacred chamber is not yet known to Ganon. It is my wish that you wait here in hiding until we return. We must go. Imagine if I did that much toying around. <laughs> I don't know how to say this. Everything that's happened to you and your poor sister, it's all been my fault. I'm so sorry. <laughs> he laughs it off. <laughs> 
Be careful. Listen well. The fact that the Master Sword lost the power to repel evil suggests to me that something has happened to the sages who infused the blade with the god's power. The sages should be here in Hyrule, in the Wind Temple to the north and the Earth Temple to the south, praying to the gods. You must head for these two temples to see what has happened to the sages and attempt to find a way to recover the power to repel evil. Unfortunately, Ganna seems to have erected some sort of magical barrier down here in Hyrule, blocking our path to the temples. But each temple should have another entrance high upon Hyrule's mountaintops, which are now islands above the sea. As always, I shall mark these places on your sea chart. If we stay here much longer, we shall draw our enemy's attention to Zelda's whereabouts. We must return to the surface immediately. You know the legend of the Hero of Time? Once long ago he defeated Ganon and brought peace to the Kingdom of Hyrule. A piece of the Triforce was given to the Hero of Time and he kept it safe much as Zelda kept hers. That sacred piece is known as the Triforce of Courage. When the Hero of Time was called to embark on another journey and left the land of Hyrule, he was separated from the elements that made him a hero. It is said that at the time the Triforce of Courage was split into eight shards and hidden throughout the land. Even I do not know where they rest, but this much I do know, they lie hidden somewhere in this great sea. Might you have crossed paths with someone who knows much about things that lie hidden in the depths of the sea? Well, fret not if you can think of no one, though maybe you would come upon the knowledge of asking around in a place where many people gather. Yeah, that would be it. <laughs> Say, I was hitting the uh, save button, so... I think uh, we'll go ahead and end it off right here. Yeah. So we'll definitely uh, stream this one again next Thursday night. And um, I will be back on, of course, uh, tomorrow night for hmm, that Mario Party challenge. <laughs> We're calling it the Swamp Fattening one. So hopefully you look forward to that. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Have a great night.